Hey y'all. I know it's been a minute. But when I tell you I need every needed every millisecond of the break that I've had. But um I really been being led to come out of my cave. So here I am with a brief message that's been um on my heart about a lesson that I'm learning and trust that um yeah I won't be long because I'm almost certain that I don't have enough storage um of data on my phone right now for something lengthy. But um you know we are always talking about self care this and self care that and woo de woo woo and what I'm learning because you know there's levels to this shit is that um you know when it comes to self care one of the things that we are encouraged to do is set boundaries uh i for one uh learned the importance of setting boundaries when um i started going to therapy and it was revealed what the concept of codependency is what that looks like how it comes about and how to overcome it uh and whatnot setting boundaries was one of the most important things that I was told to do but the thing is they tell you to set boundaries but they don't tell you how and so then um you're either faced with having to ask the question um well you ask the question you absolutely ask the question but you also do your research and you make sure to reflect and so um I just want to encourage you all as you are uh, making self-care a priority if you want to even take it a step further making soul care a priority in your life especially moving into this week um make sure that we are setting boundaries i know yesterday i intended to spend my whole day pretty much at the park i had packed a bag made me a smoothie got here started walking the plan was once i finished walking to sit down and meditate chill maybe even do a reading make some notes for an upcoming episode of co-creating that i have in mind and i got a call from somebody who it was gonna cut off i told you i told you but i'm back so what i was saying was um i set out to spend a day at the park yesterday got a call and needed to go run to one of my family members rescue uh but i told myself i'm not going to stop what i'm doing right now to go do what it is that this individual needs me to do because they did not prepare uh so i was like i'm gonna finish my walk and then i'll go take care of it and once i finish with them i'll come back um but what i learned from that was from now on when i'm in that mode and i've set that's sort of a, a plan in motion for myself and um, and just making a conscious effort to fill my cup. I'm not answering the phone. Everything has to wait because I'm putting myself first. I'm putting my soul care first and that is the priority. So I hope that in that way you all can take from how I am um, learning to set boundaries as i go i have books on it uh there are a multitude of videos on it and but i haven't really been reading or watching them i'm finding that i'm really just learning as i go and as experiences present themselves to me so that's one boundary that i am setting and another is that uh today makes the i think five month anniversary of my brother mon's passing and 316 is a number that is very much uh synchronistic for me as it relates to connecting with him and so every day at 316 i'm stopping i'm stopping to do something and to in devotion to god and honor of him um at 316 it's a hard pause and that is a boundary that i'm setting um it's also a way for me to give devotion every day and so um I just want to encourage you guys to think along those lines. You can consider this your soul food for this Sunday. I'm hoping to pick back up on the regular 
But in the meantime, in the between time, I pray that you all are well, that you have a good week. Peace.